appears the city of Jennings will continue to tow cars from private property without any type of search warrant. Fox Files investigator Mitch McCoy exposed the towing practice last month, and tonight he finds there may be occasions the city will ask for permission. Hello to you and one of the most civil conversations with the city yet. The city attorney says there may be some situations where it will go the route of getting a warrant and it being signed by a judge, but he admits that will not happen all of the time. It's a difficult issue. Sam Alton is Jennings City Attorney. He agreed to sit down and talk about the towing of vehicles from people's driveway. It's not in the street. It's not blocking the sidewalk. Deemed derelict and abandoned. I don't think that it's happened a lot. As complaints are filed, the city inspector investigates to determine if there's a public safety hazard. The inspector's next move would be to issue some type of a notice or a warning. Alton says if there's an immediate risk, a warning notice is sent, but the city typically does not get an administrative search warrant from the municipal judge. The Fox Files captured the city of Jennings towing a truck from Robert Cotton Sr.'s driveway earlier this summer. St. Louis County police were called and the truck was never towed. At the time, Cotton claimed it was over his expired tags. The city argued it was inoperable and posed a safety hazard. I think the city of Jennings is going to do what it feels that it needs to do within the letter of the law to keep its streets and its residents safe. Did the city of Jennings apply for any administrative search warrants to take cars? As far as I know, no. In violation of the law? Well, that's a different question, right? So the law, it's a little bit gray. In Culverton Park, cars are towed for having expired tags after a notice is sent and an administrative search warrant is signed by the judge. In Jennings, the city code does not require an inspector to get a judge's approval prior to calling a tow truck. Legally, would I recommend getting an administrative warrant? Sure. Can it always happen? Should it always happen? Not necessarily. It's just, it's a little bit complicated. That's the checks and balances of our government. I understand. Is the judicial branch to say, okay, you have, this city has the right to go on someone's property. So what would be your response to somebody who says, what you guys are going to do is unconstitutional going on properties without warrants. Yeah. So my response is it's a complicated situation that we have a bunch of cities, St. Louis, whether it's St. Louis County, St. Louis City, um, that want to make their streets and their municipalities as safe as they can. And they have a box of tools by which they can do that. The chairman of the Missouri House Judiciary Committee says he plans to review the state law which municipalities are using to tow cars in the next session. Alton says he's supportive of revising the law as long as it includes empathy, common sense and relevant facts that will deal with this issue more easily. For the Fox Files, I'm Mitchell McCoy.